Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, today we are gonna take a little tour around HomeSense. We used to go to HomeSense all the time because we used to live really close to it. But since we've moved house, it's not that close and it's a bit of a pain to get here. So, I haven't been in a while, so we're gonna take a little tour round. You're probably grateful that we don't come here as much, aren't you? So grateful. It's not your favorite place in the world, but I'm hoping there's going to be some really nice summery stuff, maybe some nice garden furniture. Yeah, just going to take a little tour around. I don't know if these are these outdoor plants. Yes, yeah, outdoor plants. Oh, is that a fire pit? Looks like That's pretty cool. How much is that? 60 quid. Quite like all our windows are dark grey, aren't they? Mm. So I think it'd be nice for us to get some dark greyish furniture. This set's nice, but it's just brown. 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 Oh, how cute is this little cactus pot? 40 quid? 40 quid? Oh, it's a... what is that? Oh, it's a massive citronella candle, that's why. Oh, they do a mini one. A little outdoor citronella candle 20 quid for the smaller one that's not too bad steve look at this watering can it's a unicorn oh the flamingos well they're only five quid oh stop it steve Annabelle. one day i would like a swinging egg for our garden 250 quid though Am I just a bit stingy or do you think that's quite a lot? It is expensive, it's like these, £100 each. Those are really nice. Is it, is it actually 100 quid a chair? That's ridiculous. They're nice though, aren't they? It's not actually that comfortable. I like these as well. These kind of wicker, black wickery pot. pot's quite nice. I can't speak today. Is that an outdoor artificial plant? How much is that? 80 quid. 80 quid. Maybe yeah, these are nice. See, the really big one of these is only 30 quid. I like the medium sized one, that's 20. That's not too bad. But we were talking about potentially getting some planters like this, weren't we? That looks quite deep, though. You'd have to put quite a lot of soil in that. Yeah, I guess. We are the worst people because we know nothing about plants. These little stainless steel ones quite nice. That little one's only 15. Don't know how much this big one is. Oh, that that's corner safe is really cute. 600 quid. That's really not bad for a safe, or is it? No. Oh, clearance, Steve. Hey, move it or lose it. Oh my gosh, you know, last time we came in, that's the bedside table I saw that I liked. Where's the price? Can you see the price on it? Um, there's something in price. 73? Reduced from what? I don't think there's more than one. Oh, babe, do you know what's really annoying? You know the console table we have in our bedroom? I wanted something like this, but they were too expensive, and that's reduced now to the same price that we bought our one for. Yeah. Oh, it doesn't matter, it'd be up against the wall, wouldn't it? What did you ask me if I liked? Yeah, I do like that. 40 quid? Oh, they've got loads of them. Yeah, those are really nice. That's very much our kind of style, isn't it? See, I've been trying to find something like this to go in front of the window in the kitchen because I thought that'd be really cute for Rocky to sit on he'd and look out. On yeah, but he'd like it, wouldn't he? Yeah. But I mean, it's just, it's teal and 110 quid. It's a lot. It's a lot for teal. 
if it was black or grey or something like that. You'd be all over it though. Yeah. Clearance isn't that great, is it? This is nice. Can you see a price tag on that? Oh God, Steve. <laughs> 90 quid, this one's got a tag on it, 90 quid. Oh, that'd be really nice in my dressing room. I don't really like the feet on it, but I guess you could probably remove them. Does it open? Like yeah, that? so you could use it as storage. 60 quid. No, it's not. Oh, they've got these same tables in silver as well. Those would be really nice in the office, actually. Yeah. Yeah. Bit chrome. They've got loads of those um, Ottomans. Oh, yeah. See, something like this would be really good, wouldn't it? Like a lower one. Yeah, if he's 100% sleeping on that, though, isn't he? Kind of like that golden one, but we want it more like this colour. Yeah. It's like a dark grey. I like the velvet stuff. Oh, I do love a bit of velvet, yeah. It's yeah. Great version. I prefer the pinky one. I think that look, the pink would look nicer in my dressing room, wouldn't it? It's cute though. Oh, they do loads of luggage in here. Oh <gasps> no, that is not my suitcase. It is, isn't it? Mother. <sighs> Does it come with all the ones inside it though? No, but you can, it's not quite, I think maybe that's an older style because the lines are slightly different, but it's got the big one, the medium one, and the little one. Although weirdly, the price of the big one is the same as the little one. But anyway, if people are looking for some luggage, this is a pretty good shout, so 80 quid for the big one. Mine is really good. If you wanted one, babe, because your one's a bit broken, that's 80 quid, there's a big black one for you. Yeah. Or navy blue. Oh, that question. You want black, don't you? Yeah, some of them are 50, some of them are 60. There's a few different ones. There's a jazzy, juicy couture one. This is like a bit of you, isn't it? Just black. Because mine's the kind of charcoal grey. Mm. That mint green one's quite cool. And it'd be easy to spot, wouldn't it? Yeah. I keep on seeing stuff that would be good, but I just don't like that colour. It's like the right thing, but the wrong colour. Yeah. These are really cute as well. A little love sign. Eight pounds? Would you say it's nice? You like the heart dish? Oh, I'm surprised you said you like that. It's eight pounds as well. The thing is, I always buy stuff like that and I'm never quite sure what to do with it. Do you like the little love sign? Yeah, that's alright. That's quite nice. Oh, this is the wedding section. Duh. I love all of these sofas. They have the coolest sofas in here, don't they? 700 quid as well. 700? For really, it looks really expensive though, doesn't it? That one's only 600 and it's like a scallop back one. One day in my dream mansion, I'll have a big dressing room with a nice big velvety sofa like that. Maybe not quite that big, maybe a little one like that. This one's nice. That's only 500 pounds. Oh my god, no way. It's a tiki bar. Have you seen this? No. It's like a bamboo tiki bar, 400 pounds. It's a bit much in there. Take my money now. <laughs> <laughs> you 
yeah, no, that is quite a lot to spend on something that we don't need, but need and want. Oh, this coffee table is really cool. Do you see a price tag on it? 180. 180. It was a bit wobbly when you lent on it. Steve, I wouldn't mind a chair this kind of style in our kitchen diner. Like a cuddler chair, just not in orange. £350. Oh, found another ottoman that's still the wrong colour. These pillows are really sweet. The grey with the kind of neon piping, it's really cool. They're £10 each. Well, they do loads of different colours as well. Get it? Every time I come in here, I always pick out the cushions with the pom-poms on the edge and Steve always says, no. no. Do you know I'm... No pom-poms. How long take Rocky to eat all those? Like five no. minutes flat. He wouldn't. He wouldn't do that to me. These are sweet though. He wouldn't be able to eat these kind of pom-poms. Those are 17 pounds. Have you seen any sort of... Are they, oh, are these outdoor cushions? Or these indoor jazzy cushions? I don't know actually, it doesn't say anywhere. Would you have a look at some garden furniture? Sure. Come on then. This set's really nice. 700 quid though. Oh, bar cart, we need a bar cart. 150 quid? It's a bit much, isn't it? What do you think this giant thing now? Yeah, like that. Shut up. 100 quid. The scale. Whoa, that's a pink chair. Every time we come in here, I always look at these drawers. <laughs> Don't know. Yeah, it's true, you do. Is that comfortable? It is, actually. Is it worth 200 quid? No. <laughs> what the? Oh, this is sweet. Little picnic basket. 15 quid. Oh, there's nothing in it. So much storage. I love this wicker storage. Fifteen pounds. Oh, I've lost Steve now. Steve, where have you gone? Hello. We need some storage for our ensuite and it's a bit of an awkward size isn't it? Yeah. Everything seems to be a little bit too deep. I think that's still too, too deep and it's damaged anyway. Oh these baskets are so nice. Rose gold baskets. Eight pounds. Eight pounds for a basket. It's nice. This is like storage heaven isn't it? I wanted to get some baskets. Oh, these are cute. Can you help me? I thought getting a basket like that would be really nice and putting a plant in it. An artificial one, obviously, because we'd kill it. But for the guest bedroom, because I want to go for most, more of a coasterly vibe, don't I? Yeah. But that's really nice. And put a little... Yeah? yeah? Are they the same size, those two? Yeah. Is that one a bit bigger? That one's 15 quid. That one must be a tiny bit bigger. Marginally then, yeah. Should we get this one? Should we get that one? Sure. We'll look in the doggo section. Shall we? Shall we? We shall look in the doggo section. This is where we got his llama that he absolutely loves. <laughs> no way. Look, Junior Mint. Junior Mint. Tootsie Roll. Oh yeah, Tootsie Roll. Oh, that's sweet. Oh, 
are these pee bags biodegradable? Don't know. I think they are. This is where we normally get our doggy pee bags from. We've got biodegradable those. and scented, aren't they? Mm. That looks a little bit like Gucci, that dog bed, doesn't it? I like the ones that look like little sofas. Got 50 quid though. Oh, it folds out, yeah. I was just set up before if it didn't have a zip, but if it folds out. Yeah, it's meant to fold out to a circle. Oh, these bowls are really sweet. The ones that say thirsty. Thirsty. Oh, and grey on the inside. Yeah, nice. How much is that? It's six pounds. Oh, that's a cat. That's, that's a cat. Got loads of dog shampoo, haven't we? Yeah. Oh uh, yeah. Yeah, they are degradable. Yeah, these are like twice as much in the pet store. Oh, what's this? Shampoo. Oh, this is sweet as well. A little marble dog bowl. Oh, that's only three pounds. I have a box that I keep all my hair brushes and my hair drying straighteners in and Rocky has figured out how to open it and he likes chewing the on the cable. Not, the top's not very heavy, is it? It's a really, really light, kind of cheap one, isn't it? So you can push it up. Yeah. No, it was from Aldi, I think. Oh, this one's quite nice. Because then that could double up as a chair as well. Can you see a price on that? God, their pricing is really hidden. 50. 50. Oh, I've got pockets in it though. How cool is that? Yeah. See, I was thinking that'd be really good to put my stuff in and then it can double up as a little stool as well. Yeah. But I don't know, it's 50 steep. Am I just being stingy? Yeah. For that, like, just as a little storage. Yeah. Oh, these. Oh. These ones are 40. But same kind of concept where it's a bit like a seat, isn't it? Mm. I'm not really a fan of the. What's it called? Crushed velvet. You're looking for some of your man wash. It was, yeah. Yeah, we got Steve a really nice. It's like a charcoal man body wash from here before. That's the risk of buying stuff from here is that you'll fall in love with it and then not be able to find it again. Yeah. What have we got over here? Oh, lip masks. I've never tried one of these. Meant to hydrate your lips. Have you got a dry lip babe? Always. Do you want to try some of these? Sure. Should we, have, should we have a movie night and try some lip masks? They're four quid for a pack of four. That's Real not too bad. Though. Real gold. Yeah. I just kind of want to find some bathroom storage since our cupboard is like falling apart. Oh, this is where all the shower gels and stuff are, so if you're going to find it anywhere, it's probably going to be here. Yeah, I did see that. Oh, this looks nice. Coconut hydrating body oil for f £5. Steve, I'm trying to speak here and you're talking over my interesting commentary. Coconut hydrating body oil. Oh, that sounds quite nice. I'm a sucker for packaging and I like that. Rose water nest, seven pounds. Oh, actually we do need another hand wash for the bathroom because there's none, none left in the downstairs toilet. Okay. I'm getting some of this one. I'm easy with hand soap, you can pick. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I'm probably gonna pick based on the packaging because I'm sure they all smell delightful. Right, what have we got here? I haven't seen anything that's in a really nice kind of bottle of you. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to choose. I'm just, there's so much, so much choice. Hemp hand soap, vegan and gluten and paraben free, French lavender. Should we get some of that? I like it because it's purple. That's five pounds, that one. Yeah. Yeah. We got our bed sheets from here, didn't we? Yep. I think they were maybe this brand and they're really nice. They do some really cute little throws over here as well, I just saw. I thought this was quite a sweet little throw, Steve. 
Oh, I thought it was all that pattern. Turkish Cotton Factory. £17. 130 centimetres by 180. That's probably like a single or a double, right? Yeah. Oh, this one's nice as well. Oh, I love these chunky knit throws. They look so cute. I'm trying to find a friggin' price tag. Oh, 80 quid. That's a lot. That's nice though, isn't it? It's like a chunky knit little throw. Oh, you look really angelic in that lighting. We're home. Right, just gonna talk you through what we got. We got some more coffee syrups because these are friggin' good, aren't they? Oh, you look very angelic again because of the light. So we got peanut butter cup and iced cinnamon roll. They're from Skinny Syrups, so it's no calories, no sugar. And they're four quid for a massive bottle. So we've got two of those. Oh, the receipt's stuck to it. I got some of this jo Jojoba <laughs> repairing body oil. So it's meant to be good for sort of like wrinkles, eczema, sunburns, any breakouts. But I thought potentially that might be quite good on my scars. We got some fancy hand wash for our bathroom. We got some lip masks, so we're going to have those later. But we watch a movie and just chillax. And then we got this beautiful basket. So, yeah, I feel like I should probably do an update house tour at some point. Yes. I want to do a few more bits. There's a few more rooms I want to decorate. But our guest room, which is at the moment a bit of a dumping ground, I want to have a bit more of a kind of really nice coastly theme, get some really nice prints on the wall, have a little bit of kind of wickery white vibe because there's so much black stuff in our house, like everything just needs to be black. So I'm going a bit lighter and fresh in the guest room. So I thought I'd just put an artificial tree in here, which I don't have yet, and have it as more of a kind of plant pot. So that was £15 for the basket. And that's from, ooh, Indonesian Coastal Collection. And that is it. So I think we spent about 30 quid in total, which is pretty good for us, isn't it? Yeah, it's not too bad. We normally spend a lot more. <laughs> right, that is everything. So if you guys have enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up because it really supports my channel. And if you haven't already subscribed, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And I will see you guys next time.